Steri is the name of Inotech's hot glass bead sterilizer. It sterilizes instantly small laboratory instruments. In principle, Inotech sterilizers are metallic boxes well insulated with a heating mantle inside and a sterilizing well filled with glass beads. These beads are heated to 250 degrees Celsius. 250 degree glass beads will completely destroy within 10 to 15 seconds microbes and spores on the surface of metal or glass instruments. Steris are available in two sizes. Steri 250 has a sterilizing well of 4 times 8 cm. Steri 350 has a sterilizing well of 4 times 14 cm. All instruments contain a high performance heating element, a high precision thermostat, a temperature limiter and a built-in thermometer. The operation of our steady is simple and rapid. First, fill the heating well with the supplied glass beads. Then turn the power switch on and wait 20 minutes till temperature indicator shows 250 degrees. When the temperature of the sterilizer reached the 250 degree, stick your instrument into the glass beads. Do not touch the beads. You can touch the box because it is well insulated and is normal warm. After 10 to 15 seconds which is a fairly short time. Now we have 10 seconds. Remove the pieces and go do your work. Don't leave the instruments longer than 30 seconds inside the beads or it may become very hot. You can leave the steri during the day turned on. Turn steri only off at the end of your working day. In the box you will find a dust lid close the sterilizing well with the lid because each dust which will fall inside will be carbonized. When you insert 
dirty instruments into the sterilizer. The dirt will be baked on the instruments and stick to the beads. Beads which have a deposit on it will turn brownish and do not transfer heat as efficient as necessary. It is therefore recommended to replace the glass beads when they become discolored. The performance of the sterilizers is validated by the spore suspension test in US Pharmacopeia 22 part 1211. In USA and Canada sterilizers are also approved UL and CE listed in Europe. But please take care that these are not approved by the FDA for human medical applications.